What's going on guys and welcome to Gone Home, a fantastic new game that is actually relatively short, but it's got a good story. So let's uh, just hop right into it. Yes. Start. Hi, Mom. Uh, so I got my ticket home from Europe. I get back on June 6th, but it's a really late flight because that was the cheapest, so it gets in at midnight. But don't worry, I'll get a shuttle from the airport so you don't have to pick me up. Like, really seriously, you don't have to. <laughs> okay, so, love you. See you soon. Bye. So we're gonna hope that the game lets me play in full screen like this. June 7th, 5, 1.15 a.m. Awesome. Um, I tried playing already, and it, uh, it runs kind of weirdly, and, and my, uh, yeah. So I will change that. Uh, that should be better. A little bit. Like that. Alright. see if I can get everything right here. Okay then. Should be pretty easy. Locked, locked. Oh, so, um actually yeah, let me let me change that real quick too, if you guys don't mind. Um is that on that? Was it on uh controls maybe? No. That'd be tree messages. Hmm. Oh wait, maybe it's disable interaction, highlight disable interaction text. Is that it maybe? No, it's not. What the hell? I think it's in the beginning, but Oh well, we'll just go with it. So Katie, I'm sorry I can't be there to see you, but it is impossible. Please, please don't go digging around trying to find out where I am. I don't want anyone to know. See each other again someday. Don't be worried. I love you, Sam. I actually really want to get rid of that. It's going to bother the crap out of me, so I'm gonna be right back. Alright, I was able to figure out it was actually in language. The overlay text, I assume it's the overlay text. Yes, it is. Uh, this way I don't have to, this way I won't pop up twice on I me. Mean, that's just annoying as all hell. Um, I have seen some gameplay, like, I don't like that if uh, you just click it once and open it. I don't know. It's because I. Play too much amnesia. Ooh, grab this. Press right mouse or left shift to examine the held object. Oh, that's kind of cool. Spin around like crazy. And then just toss you. Cool. Ooh, a key. Hey, that's key. We got some long range here, too. I like that. Press one or I to check the contents of your backpack. Ooh, hello. And then map is two, three is journals. All right, so we got a key that was hidden under an old Christmas duck. Ah, frames, why are you failing? That's a joyful house, isn't it? All right, close those. And, uh, ooh, open folder. Read inputs. All right, destination, yep. Holy crap. Sixteen hundred dollars, twenty-seven hundred total. That's fucked up. Dear Katie, so much has changed, even just since you've been away. We moved into this house. All right, sorry. Give me one second. I'm going to. Uh... All right. It's not in here. Sticky targeting. Get out of here. No one wants you. I'm at a new school. It's annoying as hell. And my big sister being gone for a year doesn't make it any easier. Oh, okay. It doesn't okay. feel real. But I'm not gonna let it phase me. I used to tell you everything. And if I can't do it in person, because you're off gallivanting around who knows where, I'll tell it to this journal. Just like I was talking to you. Alright, cool. 
Wow. Directions to work from a new home. Is the worst. One hour, ten minutes. Wow. That is the worst handwriting I've ever seen. I've seen some bad handwriting. Anything in there? Nope. Oh, good. What's in here? Anything? Grab board game. Whee! We're back. Oh, that's cool. You just put it right back. Um, doesn't seem to be anything in here, so we'll just close that. Alright, cool. So this is a very, very interactive game, if you can't tell. Oh, I can't turn that on. We can turn that on, though. Sam, Katie, Mom, and Dad. Alright. <clears throat> Turn you on to. Sam, Daniel from the old neighborhood called. He wants to come see the new house. Call him back. Mom, Daniel is a total weirdo. The only reason I ever hung out with him in the first place is he had a Nintendo when we were little. It's a good reason. Joyful in a nice dark hallway. Turn that on. Thank you. Close that door. Open this one. There's two where I'm to check. Vacation in the house. Ooh, this is gonna be cool. Alright. Turn you on. Ooh, a message. Welcome, new student. We hope that you are excited about your first day at Goodfellow High School, as we are. Please be sure to bring the following with you on your first day of classes so that you can get right into the swing of things. One sturdy folder with pockets for each of your six class periods one line notebook per period, or one large notebook with six divided sections, at least six pens, blue or black ink, and six pencils. I can't just have one of them. Anyway, one box of colored pencils. What, you don't have to have six? A standard combination lock for your scent locker because we're too cheap to make or to give you one ourselves. A nutritious lunch or two fifty for lunch provided by the school cafeteria, and a positive attitude because we have to make this look like a decent fucking note. Please remember to to get plenty of sleep the night before and be ready for the first bell to ring at 8 a.m. See you soon, and again, welcome. Crazy signature from Beth Valance, the principal. Oh my god. You are so lucky you finished high school before we moved into this house. So, it's the first day of school. 
And there I am, introducing myself to the class. And I say that I just moved into the house on Arbor Hill. All of a sudden, every kid in the room turns and just stares like I suddenly transformed into a mutant. <laughs> I just stood there, wishing pretty hard for a rewind button. Because now maybe nobody knows my name, but they all know who I am. The Psycho House Girl. <sighs> Great. Fantastic. Okay, so those postcards are sent. Let's see. Hi, Mom, Dad, and Sam. I'm in Paris. I have done many Parisian things, including eating. Really? I'm wearing a beret. There we go. I'm going to have lots of women to vote when I get back. Sam, I'm bringing you back something from the Shakespeare Book Company since you are my favorite sister. I love you all, Katie. Cool. I guess. That back. Grab a photo. Ooh, who's this? No name on the back. Just Soto. Just cute. Put you back. Back of cards. Oh, I can't use them. That's disappointing. Oscar Doc Mason. Oscar Mason, 60, of Boone County, died peacefully last month in his home. Mr. Mason was born on September 8, 1933 in the house that would be his home for the rest of his life. He attained his degree in pharmacy at a young age and returned to Boone County to practice. He quickly became a well-off figure at the center of the community in the decades preceding his passing. He was seldom seen outside his home. A service will be held this Sunday at the First Methodist Church at 1 p.m. All are welcome. Uh, his survivors include... His survivors include nephew... Terence Greenbrier, which I believe is our last name, as well as in spirit of the people of Bunkai, to whom we provide wellness and comfort. No, oh, joyful. He died in this house. Fantastic. Well, we're actually going to walk back out here, and I will end it here. And actually, I want. Actually, no, never mind. So, we'll end it here, guys. So, thanks for watching, and, uh, if you enjoy this game so far, feel free to subscribe for more videos and all that good stuff. And uh, we'll see you guys soon with more Gone Home.